Hey, hello there Aquarius. Welcome to your weekly prediction. This week's card reading covers July 29th to August 4th of 2018. This is a general reading, so please only take what resonates with you. I can answer your more specific questions when you book a reading. Just go ahead and send me an email. Thank you. There are free readings every week. To enter to win, press that notifications bell and comment. Then you're automatically entered. I have shuffled, meditated over, and blessed this reading just for you, Aquarius. Your first card, it's the basis of the matter. It's the general atmosphere of that week. It's the background of the question. The Eight of Pentacles. The Eight of Pentacles. That stands for craftsmanship and applying your skills in a productive manner. You're being conscientious. And as long as you're sincere and persevere, your efforts are going to succeed. You're devoting yourself and you're spending your efforts on making money. You're paying attention to details. And it could be because there's going to be some employment to come. Someone is learning a new skill like being an apprenticeship and it is the beginning of a profitable undertaking and you're being dedicated to your tasks your second card and it's the energy crossing over your path it's the immediate future it's occurring now the page of swords the page of swords is bringing in air energy could be an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra, or a message. It also stands for vigilance and news. There may be conflicts that are going to clear out, but you are feeling some nervousness and anxiety. There may be some spying going on or news of difficulties. You need to analyze and strategy is needed to confront others. Someone may be behaving in a risky manner. It could be the overconfidence or ignorance of youth. And if it's that, it, it can cause strife. Or there may be rumors and gossip. It could be a deceitful person around you. Your third card, and this is how it affects you. In a major way, it's the fool number zero of the major arcana in the rider weight deck the fool a choice is offered it's also a leap of faith you to trust life and if you follow your instincts you will be provided with guidance there's a new way of life coming you could be moving it could be a new job maybe a marriage or a divorce but it's the first step and despite your initial fear, as long as you react with a pure heart and innocence, divine spirit will help. You have enthusiasm. You may be acting on a whim and you should enjoy the moment. Your fourth card, it's the outcome. It's the results or the advice and how to respond. Another major card. This is number 20, Judgment. Number 20 of the Major Arcana in the Rider Waite deck, Judgment. This is a spiritual awakening. This is an aha moment. This is a rebirth. It's being inspired. There's a major breakthrough. This is a new phase. It's a wake up call. It's solving old problems and you're going to be finding peace. It's like a second lease on life. You're going to be leaving the past behind. You're going to gain some new knowledge and finally your health is going to be improving. This card also stands for the zodiac sign of Scorpio. Your fifth card, it's the bottom of the deck card. It's what's unseen or underlying the issue the Eight of Wands. The Eight of Wands. Something fast is really going to happen. 
this new beginning is finally going to happen this week. There's movement and action, could maybe even be air travel, but things are going to happen rapidly. It's going to be a busy and very exciting and very hopeful period, and super positive things are going to be unfolding very rapidly. It's the end of delay. This also stands for messages, and it could be letters of love, but there is an approach to a goal, and you're reaching a conclusion. There may be surprises and new opportunities, and you're going to need to act quickly, and you're going to have to multitask. Thank you so much, Aquarius. Thank you for your wonderful comments and validations and subscribes. I really am grateful. Now remember, what goes around comes around. So keep it positive. Love and light. Thank you.